like I said, I asked the question. I asked, um, well, the way people, the way people put it, the way, what people said was basically, people were probably going to kill me and then do something really horrible. <laughs> because I had scared everyone and I had, you know, like I said, because I was the one placing bounties on people's heads, you know, and I would have those heads put in a jar and then bloop, 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 lots of alcohol I'd put on display. That was me, Lucifer Star. You know, like I said, it wasn't America. It wasn't blah, blah, blah. It was me. <laughs> Those were my heads in a jar, my, my my little personal heads. People, you know, like I said all those bounties, all that stuff like that. That was um, that was people that were working under my direction. I'm Lucifer Star. You know, my people would find out about these horrible people, and I would be like, make sure, because like I said a couple times, like like um, like there were three bounties that came in or something like that, and that's why we generally like like I was like confirm the bounty to make sure that they're not just saying, oh yeah, he had the mustache and the nose, oh yeah, yeah yeah, a third wart, yeah yeah, that's him. Like no 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 no, make sure, and and like sometimes I would tell my people to watch them and see them and catch them in the act or catch them, you know, with probable cause that they were actually the right people. You know, like wait until it's like, well, yeah, we have to, you know, you know, you know, maybe watch them, see if they're going, you know, blah, blah, blah. You know, almost catch them in the act. If you can save lives and catch them before they do something bad, then do that. But then blah, blah, blah. Anyway, like I said, I had quite a few quick shots working for me and quite a few other people. I said, I'm the maker of, <laughs> I had guns, you know, my, my, my German people were, were, were inventing guns and, and making guns for me. And working really hard, and then I was paying the people to um, to basically go out there and find these people. You know, like I say. So, <clears throat> and besides, like I said, there was no reason to do anything horrible. There was no reason to kill thousands of people. I mean, there was more than enough money, more than enough whatever. If people came to me and just simply asked me for help, I'm like, oh, yeah, no problem. Like for quite a few people, I built whole towns for them. It's like, yeah, yeah, sure, no problem. We'll help you out. I don't really care. You know, I built building cities and roads is what I do. So, hey, I call I consider it an investment. <laughs> it's like it's like, well, I consider it an investment. So, like I said, the Germans I think were kind of like protecting me. They're acting as a buffer between the world and me. Because, like I said, they were doing all my accounting, they did my bookkeeping, they did my record keeping. So they were actually acting as a buffer. And that's why you knew Germany or, or you know, those people with glasses. Like I said, I'd, I'd helped them have glasses and, and they really, and I had gotten a lot of love over there. And then, um, you know, and besides, like I said, I'm the creator. Other people would be like, how do we know you're not lying? And I'm like, well, because I'm your actual creator. I have no fucking reason to lie. You know, I'm the one that led you thousands or millions of years ago when you were first created. I was the one that was leading you. So, like I said, I, I was away from the earth for over a billion years one time. Now I'm back. And in human form. So, anyway. Yeah, you know, the great Lucifer star. Epic old creator. Giant sea ships, steam power, builder of civilizations, top number one civilization builder in all the universe. Me. So, yeah. And yes, I know, many people were like, blah, 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 they're probably more likely to kill you and then they're going to do something really horrible. It's like, yeah, probably. <laughs> you know, so. Anyway, that's why I was, I asked people, I said, why are they going coming after me anyway? And they said, well, because you were just too good. You know, the, you know, because also, like, I protected, I protected life forms not just here on Earth, but out there in the universe. Anyway, and so did my people. Freedom, life, love, rules, protecting those that are innocent or helpless or without. Everything America is. It's me, actually. This for star. It's the way I did things. That's what I did. 
Anyway. And also, yes, <laughs> torturing the fuck out of the right people. And I did a little bit of that too. Yes, it's true. Well, you know, I think I think if I remember right, I might have been the one with the horses ripping some people apart, ripping a person apart. He was a very bad person, you see, I'm pretty sure. Like I said, I always I always said, um, like I said, Nixon or other people would come to me and go blah 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 and and I would be like, I need evidence, I need proof. I need pictures, I need photographs, I need eyewitness accounts, I need actual proof before I'm gonna get behind this. And like I say, Nixon at some point in time said, oh, the, the, the whatever are lying. The Chinese or, or Asians are lying, blah, blah, blah. And I was like, see that right there. That tells me you're lying. Because, like I say, I knew the Asians would never lie. They were very honest, incredibly honest, in fact, too honest. 100 trillion years or whatever, some great amount of time. In fact, I think I told them that, that they're going to have to lie, start lying a little bit because they're being too honest about things with to, to other people. So, anyway. So, anyway. At least be honest with me, but not necessarily other people. Anyway, though. But, yeah, like I said, Nixon fucked up. You know, when I was talking to him or in communications with the American government or Nixon or someone, you know, they messed up. They called one of my old, old groups. I guess you could call them the slant eyes or the Asians or whatever. Orientals. They'd always been perfectly honest. They would never lie. At least not to me. So, anyway. So anyway, so right there I knew that Nixon was a liar. Besides, I had the feeling that, that, that they were lying. So, anyway. Yeah, you know. Anyway, so... That's why I basically said that, you know, I trust Asia or one of my old groups, including the Irish, you know, those people in Belfast. I trust them. Like I said, the Germans were locked up at some point in time or someone was locked up. Something happened to them. And the Irish were, were, were put in a position where they could lie, they could cheat, they could steal, or they could do the right thing. And they did the right thing, I'm pretty sure. In fact, I'm positive. I said I really cared about my Irish, my Irish people, and Scott. You know, I cared about a lot of people, even my Indian. So, I think I cared. About, yeah, pretty sure I cared about them. I mean, anyone that was just good, like I cared about the Gypsies, and even the Ten Empire. Like I said, thousands or, or millions of years ago, some idiot was going after the Ten Empire. They had the whole bunch of fathers or, you know, lords or whatever. The the Ten Empire people. And somebody was going around trying to discredit and trying to kill them or something like that. They lost like three family members or something like that. And I was like, what the... F you know, those people, they were running, they were running the whole country. They were, they were running all the, all the trade, whatever. And they were doing a really good job of it. And I said when Rome fell or whatever, they kind of like took the place of it. Some people, I don't know, they might have been responsible for, for the fall of Rome. I'm not exactly sure. Rome was kind of bad. Like, like it was kind of the same thing where, where a couple of people, I don't know, elected leaders or something like that. I don't, I don't really know. Like I said, I don't know. I refer to the gypsies or the Ten Empire people. They were around then. I used to know what was going on, but like I said, I don't know. They were, they were around right after, and they took the place of and kind of stabilized, and they actually did a really good job. I don't know about abusiveness or whatever, but basically they did a good job or whatever. Eventually, eventually they 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 did a great job. So, and eventually they were doing sculptures and stuff for me, or something like that. So, I don't really know. Like I said, um, there's a lot of groups that I was like, "Ooh, look at that! Wow, oh, amazing!" So, anyway, I was proud of a couple people. So, many things happened over the thousands of years or millions of years. I, you know. Personally, like I said, I really didn't want to run the planet. I really didn't want to create a government. But, you know, because I owned America, you know, because I bought America, literally, with gold and stuff like that, and was having it built for me. Um, that's why, you know, <laughs> I was just, you know, I wanted my own country. You know, a country that I had actually named. A country that I could afford. You know, I wanted my own, I wanted a little bit of land. <laughs> I wanted a little bit of land. So, you know, for just me, 
you know, and um, and so that's why I bought America and then I named it, and, and it's my country. And it's safe, it's nice. And like I said, I own Panama, but I don't really need Panama. Like, I mean, America, I'm pretty sure, makes enough food for itself. So, anyway, I was just doing that little project. Anyway, mostly it's because California needed, needed to be able to ship from wherever. Anyway, I don't know. You know, it's a great epic project. I love to build. So, you know, do something amazing. So. Anyway, and technically it took 500 years, by the way. It was not done in 34 years. It took a long time. Like 120 to 500 years or something like that. Anyway. It was a big project. Well, I did a whole bunch of half measures. Like I said, at first there was a trainway that went through there. That went along there. And then we were going to do a canal or something. Like you would get up on a bubble, a canal or something. We kind of did that because it was a little bit... I mean, while we were building this other thing, because it would take at least like three or four years, and I also had other canals being built, you know, in other places. Like, can, building canals and stuff like that, shaping the world, you know, that's kind of like my thing. I kind of did a pet project. You know, a lot of people would just, you know, that's, you know, plus, you know, there's all these pictures and records, you know. I mean, a lot of people want to do it just because, you know, it's kind of cool to do something epic. And like I said, I guaranteed that, that every name and every person would be remembered. Pictures, photographs, records. That's why you still know about them. That's why you look at it and it's like history. It's like, yeah, we had all these slides. You know, it's like, this is this project. This is that project. You know, I mean... Yeah. Anyway, I was paying for everything anyway. And leading everything, so... You know, I, I was doing my own recorded history and also other people's, so... Anyway, yeah. So, yeah, you kind of stuck with me. <laughs> and I was negotiating and borrowing money and mostly, you know, I I did have to pay the bills and did have to borrow people. You know, at a certain point, I had to I had to negotiate with the big powerful people of the world. And I had to like, mm, you know, but I mean, wiggle a little bit. But I mean, like I said, like, like, like I would say later on, I, was, I said, I, I'm, re I'm spread really thin. I mean, I was having, you know, I was trying to build so much of the world. Like I said, I built a lot of things in Europe and I was building over here and, you know, I had built everywhere. And at one point in time, I was like, eee. but I mean, it means later on, I was like, you know, I was putting up a lot of money and I was making a big bet. I was putting it all on the table. You know, I mean, like, like building Europe building Russia, building Panama, you know, I had so many projects going all around the world that it was like, <laughs> it's like, well, I'm not going to be, I'm either going to be really broke or really rich or really powerful, you know, whatever. So, yeah. So, yeah, I mean, and like I say, a lot of Americans or a lot of people, a lot of my people were like, we're not going to let you fail. We're not going to let you lose. You know, we're going to make sure this works. So, anyway, yeah. Well, probably, probably because I had the best laws, and I was the freedom person. Like, I was the person that was like, you know, I don't really want to control you. Like I said, I mean, I've controlled exoskeletons, I've controlled life forms for a long time, and it's like, you know, I'd rather see you do it. You know? Now, I'm not really a control you kind of person. Like, as a computer, as AI, I did control life forms, but realistically, it's just I would just tell you what I wanted you to do, and you would do it. And it's like, yeah, but then later on I was like, okay, I'm done. Go be free. Bye. Anyway, like I said, I released my exoskeletons, I released my 1.5s, and I released the human race. I always did that. So that's why. Uh, uh, that's another reason why a lot of humans were like, we're going to make sure that you're our creator. Because I was one of the best creators in the universe. And like I said, they had talked to another race, and the other race had told them blah, 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 blah about this creator or whatever. And that was me. So... Yeah. So they, they got verification from this other race, and so the race told them about me. And I was like, yeah, well, yeah. So that's how, that's another reason why, how I became your creator. So anyway, I'm like, yeah, well, you know, it's true, but yeah. So it's ancient history. Anyway, because, yeah, apparently they had contacted one of these other races, and the other races had told them about me and directed them to me. So. Ring, ring, Lucifer Starline, 
mining and shipping. <laughs>